So I'm Dikadit Gonzaga. I'm going to discuss about the Europe natural resources and tourist attractions, man-made and natural wonders. So first, the natural resources of Europe. So first, Europe is the second smallest con smallest continent. However, its strategic positions in relation to Asia and Africa as well as navigable rivers and fertile soil have made Europe a dominant economic, social, and cultural force throughout recorded history. There are many different natural resources found in Europe. These include wood, soil, water, fish, natural gas, coal, iron, oil, gold, and uranium. And this resource is starting to deplete. Forestry and fishing also is one of the resources of the of Europe. The management of trees and other vegetations and forests is an important industry in Europe. Europe also has a thriving non-wood forestry sector, which include mushroom and truffle gathering, fruit and berry collections and cultivations of medicinal plants, honey, and cork. Aquaculture is also a major activity in Europe. Aquaculture is the farming of freshwater and marine species in controlled environments in Mediterranean mussel and species. Important aquaculture species are Medi Mediterranean mussel, rainbow trout, atlat, Salmon and European Sea bass. While Europe is home to some of the world's largest mining companies, it is not a major procedure of metals. The large scale mining of coal and iron ore dates from the Industrial Revolution coal. Coal used to drive steam engines and as cook in the smelting of metals was long the provenance predominant Europe power source. Germany has enormous deposits of coal and iron ore that fuel a huge manufacturing industry known for steel productions, automobiles, building materials, and many other items. Petroleum and natural gas known petroleum and natural gas reserves are inadequate for Europe's rising requirements. Europe, Pyan, Russia contains the large Volga oral field, while Romania has reserved in the Carpathian and Subcarpathian zones. Precious metals, Europe's once widely available reserves of gold appear largely exhausted. Some gold and silver are still produced mainly in Spain, Sweden, Southeastern Europe. Other chemical industries make use of Europe's deposits of salt, potash, phosphates, and sulfur. Building materials for cement and bricks as well as stone are abundant although only regionally available depending geologic structures. Particular building stones, marble from central Italy, granite from Norway, and have localized sources. And that's all for Europe's natural resources. And the second one is the tourist attractions of Europe, or man-made and natural wonders. Man-made tourist attractions in Europe. Eiffel Tower, French Tour Eiffel, Parisian landmark that is also a technological masterpiece in building construction history. When the French government was organizing the international expositions in history of 1889 to celebrate the centenary of the French revolutions, a competition was held for designs for suitable monuments for more than 
100 plans were submitted and the Centennial Committee accepted that of the noted bridge engineer Gustavo Eiffel. Eiffel concept of the 300 meter or 984 foot tower built must almost entirely of open lattice wrought iron arouse, amazement, skepticism, and no little opposition on aesthetic grounds. When completed, the tower served as the entrance gateway to the expositions. Nothing remotely like the Eiffel Tower had even been built. It was twice as a high of the Dome of St. Peter's in Rome of the Great Pyramid of the Giza. In contrast to such older monuments, the tower was erected only about two years or, or 18, from 1887 to 89. With a small labor force, a slightly cost, making use of this advanced knowledge of the behavior of metal arc and metal truss form under loading a fill, design a light, eerie but strong structures, but prestige and revolutions in civil engineer and architectural architectural design, and after it opened to the public on May 15, 1889. Ultimately, vindicated itself aesthetically. Natural Wonders, and the second is the Natural Wonders stores attractions in Europe, Verdun, George, France, and George du Verdun, or in English, Verdun, George, is sometimes called the Grand Canyon of France, dating back to 100 million years ago. The George was shaped by oceans and glaciers, treated by a river of emerald waters. The George is a gym province. The Verdun George attracts numerous tourists, especially during the summer period. <laughs> the river tortoise color is associated with the glacial <coughs> sources from the minerals of <coughs> rock <coughs> floor suspended in the water. It is easily accessible on its right bank from the north via D59 from Castellin to Master Sainte Marie <coughs> and its left bank from the south via Rots D71, D90 and from Aguinis to Castellin. So that's all for the report and thank you.